So, are hydrogen cars really going to take over EVs? Well, my answer is yes. See, the global transportation industry faces a massive challenge as the demand to address climate change amplifies, the search for a sustainable solution intensifies. So far, electric vehicles seem to have surged ahead, capturing the public's imagination and market share. Just look at companies like Tesla and Rivian and all the other EV divisions of the big car brands. However, lurking in the back that no one really talks about are hydrogen fuel cell vehicles or FCVs, which offer, in my opinion, a solution that's thousands of times better than EVs. Imagine being able to charge your car in the same amount of time it takes up to fill up a gas tank, or being able to hear the roar of your engine and not some dull frequency played out through a speaker. And I'm not kidding, just take a listen to Toyota's own hydrogen engine and what it sounds like. And all that while still being environmentally friendly and sustainable. Ooh. See, the truth is, my friends, hydrogen cars are the future and real car enthusiasts would always choose an engine over a battery. However, this is not a bash towards EVs. In fact, I think they're some of the most fun cars to drive. The response time's insane and riding in even a Tesla SUV can feel as fast as a BMW M3. So strap in as we dive deep into the countless reasons why hydrogen engines are going to knock out EVs in the coming future. Alright, the concept of using hydrogen as a fuel isn't a modern phenomenon. Engineers in the 19th century already recognized the potential of hydrogen as an energy source. However, it's the astounding strides in technology over the past few decades that have transformed hydrogen from a lab curiosity to a viable propulsion alternative. Today's hydrogen vehicles employ fuel cells, a marvel of engineering where hydrogen reacts with oxygen. This reaction produces electricity that powers the vehicle, and it also releases nothing but water vapor into the atmosphere. Such a clean process has immense applications for environmental sustainability, and releasing water as you drive is not only good for the environment, but it'll make you you feel better versus charging an electric car with electricity from coal plants. Which, by the way, if you haven't noticed, is also a huge factor in climate change. Now one undeniable advantage that sets hydrogen vehicles apart from their electric counterparts is their refuel time. Consider the experience of most EV users today. Even with fast chargers, refueling an electric vehicle demands a significant time investment, often stretching beyond an hour. And in our fast-paced world, where time's a premium commodity, waiting for a car to charge can be a substantial deterrent for potential buyers. Hydrogen vehicles in stark contrast offer the familiarity and speed of conventional refueling, taking mere minutes to fill up a tank that can provide a range comparable to, if not superior, than most EVs. But the merits of hydrogen don't end at convenience. True sustainability encompasses the entire product life cycle. Here, EVs face scrutiny. The production of EV batteries is resource intensive. Extracting minerals like lithium, cobalt, and nickel often entails environmental degradation and significant carbon emissions. It damages local infrastructure and pollutes the land and drinking water, not to even mention the child labor that's used to mine those materials in continents like Africa. The recycling and disposal of used EV batteries remain a challenge too, with potential long-term ecological implications. Hydrogen, on the other hand, when derived from sustainable methods, especially green electrolysis powered by renewable sources, presents a comprehensive green solution. By leveraging surplus renewable energy to produce hydrogen, we can achieve a transport solution that's sustainable for its whole life, from production to emission. Another reason why hydrogen will destroy EVs is because it's more adaptable. While EVs currently dominate the light vehicle market, challenges arise when considering heavier transportation means. Battery weight and volume constraints hinder EV applicability for long-haul trucks, trains, or ships. Hydrogen, with its impressive energy density, emerges as a viable contender in these segments. There's active research and pilot projects channeling hydrogen's potential for maritime rail and even aviation applications. Thus, hydrogen transcends the limitations of being a niche solution, positioning itself as a universal green fuel. People always like to talk about the lack of hydrogen refueling stations. While the concern is valid, it's worth noting that all transformative technologies face initial infrastructural hurdles. The same thing happened with gasoline vehicles and even EVs witnessed a similar challenge. The trajectory for hydrogen, however, looks optimistic, with private enterprises, international coalitions, and governments investing heavily in hydrogen research and infrastructure, the future promises an expansive hydrogen 
Asian ecosystem. Countries like Japan and Germany are pioneers, but many others are rapidly catching up, recognizing hydrogen's strategic and environmental significance. The rise of the hydrogen economy presents vast economic opportunities as countries ramp up their hydrogen production and infrastructure development. There's potential for job creation across multiple sectors, from research and development to construction, maintenance, and logistics. With global economies grappling with unemployment and economic downturns, the hydrogen sector emerges as a beacon of hope, offering sustainable jobs that align with a greener future. Moreover, as international collaborations strengthen around hydrogen, we might even witness the dawn of a new era of energy trade with hydrogen-rich countries becoming pivotal players in the global market, just like how Saudi Arabia was during the oil crisis. Now last but not least, we have to talk about safety concerns. Safety has always been the main concern when it comes to hydrogen, because it's so flammable. However, with modern technological advancements, these risks are being meticulously addressed. Today's hydrogen storage solutions use robust tanks that can withstand severe impacts. The refueling protocols and systems are designed with multiple safety checks, ensuring that the process is leak-proof and secure. Moreover, continuous investments in research are further enhancing the safety profile of hydrogen as a fuel, making it comparable to, if not safer than, conventional fuels. The transportation landscape of the future will undoubtedly be a mosaic, with multiple sustainable solutions coexisting. While the debate around the superiority of EVs versus FCVs will persist, it's essential to recognize and respect the unique advantages each brings to the table. In this dynamic era, hydrogen stands out with its versatility, scalability, and genuine commitment to sustainability. As we cruise into the future, hydrogen doesn't merely represent another fuel. It symbolizes a hope, a promise, and a commitment to a planet where progress and preservation walk hand in hand. Our collective vision of a greener, cleaner world unburdened by the shackles of carbon emissions finds a beacon of hope in hydrogen. It invites us to imagining bustling cities with clear skies, highways devoid of smog, and industries thriving without compromising our planet. Thank you so much for joining me. Please make sure to like and subscribe Subscribe if you enjoyed the video and comment what you think lies ahead for the future of cars. It'll also help me buy my dream car which is a 2010 Lexus IS250. So thank you guys. And until next time, peace.